everyone, welcome to Magic Math. Today, we will learn more addition. First, do you remember what we learned in Lesson 1 and Lesson 2? We learned addition up to 5 and different ways of adding up to 5. Before our new lesson today, let's review the concept of adding. Let's watch again the video of adding balls to the inflatable pool. Adding makes it more and more. Do some warm ups. Let's count the donuts with Buddy the dog. Soon we'll use these numbers in math exercises. First, let's count from 1 to 10. Count with me 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Good job! <laughs> now, let's learn addition up to six in different ways. We called the dinosaur family for help. Oh no, no ninja much! Ouch, 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 ouch! Don't poke me with your tail, one dinosaur said. No, I think you ran into my tail. It's not my fault, says another dinosaur. The dinosaurs seem very excited to meet you, since I told them that they would meet a math genius today. What's your name? Grandpa Dinosaur asks. What? I can't hear well, because last week, two squirrel families moved into my ears. All I can hear now is the nut cracking sound. How about let's call you Little Math Genius, if you don't mind. What did you say? You said OK, right? OK, then. Now, let's play a game together, the hide and seek game. First. Let's count how many dinosaurs there are in total. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Great job in counting. There are six dinosaurs in total. Now, please close your eyes while the dinosaurs hide. No peeking. Let's count how many dinosaurs are not hidden behind the tree. One, right. And how many dinosaurs are hidden behind the trees? Let's count. One, two, three, four, and five. Impressive. So one plus five equals six. Do you see the first dinosaur? Yes, there it is. How many dinosaurs have we found? Two. Right. And how many dinosaurs are still hidden behind the trees? Let's count. One, two, three, and four. Good job. So two plus four equals six. Do you see the dinosaurs with his feet out? Great. You found it. How many dinosaurs have we found? Three. Right. And how many dinosaurs are still hidden behind the tree? Let's count. One, two, and three. Well done. So three plus three equals six. Do you see the dinosaur with his neck and head sticking out on top of the tree? Nice! Good eye! 
How many dinosaurs have we found? Four. Right. And how many dinosaurs are still hidden behind the tree? Let's count. One and two. Good job. So four plus two equals six. Do you see the dinosaur that's upside down? Correct. What a silly way to hide. How many dinosaurs have we found? Five. Right. And how many dinosaurs are still hidden behind the tree? Right. One. Good job. So five plus one equals six. Impressive. Now we learn five different ways of adding up to six. And it seems that the order of the numbers in the addition doesn't matter. One plus five and five plus one both equal to six. Two plus four and four plus two both equal to six. Now, let's take the challenge up a level. Let's do some addition exercises with the giant panda family. How many pandas do you see in total? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Great! We see seven pandas in total. Now, let's solve some math puzzles. First puzzle. One plus what equals seven? Hmm. Let's think about it and draw it out. First, Let's underline the first panda and connect it to number one. How many pandas are not counted? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Right, six pandas. So one plus six equals seven. work on the second puzzle. Two plus what equals seven? Let's repeat what we did for the first puzzle and draw it out. Let's underline the first two pandas and connect them to number two. How many pandas are not counted? Let's count. One, two, three, four, and five. Right, five pandas. So two plus five equals seven. Good job. Now, let's work on the third puzzle. Three plus what equals seven? Let's draw it out. Let's underline the first three pandas and connect them to the number three. How many pandas are not counted? Let's count. One, two, three, and four. Right, four pandas. So three plus four equals seven. Well done. Now, let's work on the next three puzzles using the tricks we just learned. First puzzle, six plus what equals seven? Let's recall what we learned. Do you remember that the order of the numbers in addition doesn't matter? So one plus six and six plus what both equal to seven? Right, six plus one equals to seven. Second puzzle, five plus what equals to seven? Remember that the order of numbers in addition doesn't matter. Great job! Both 2 plus 5 and 5 plus 2 equals to 7. The last puzzle. 4 plus what equals 7? Again, let's apply the trick that in the order of numbers in the addition doesn't matter. Impressive! Yes, both 3 plus 4 and 4 plus 3 equals to 7. Now that you have learned different ways of adding up to seven, you can apply the same trick and solve more puzzles. 
For example, different ways of adding up to 8, 9, or 10. Please subscribe and then download the practice sheet to deepen your understanding and solve some addition problems. Here are some sample pages of our practice sheet. If you liked our video, click like and please subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Please, 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 please watch Actor Cheese.